Yeah, if you want to see the perfect ending, I guess go watch my Your own. series, yes. Pop. Yeah. I'm not shilling, though, if yeah. you want the good one. Did you laugh, Teddy? <laughs> no, I'm seriously <laughs> not shilling. <laughs> He's like, ha! <laughs> um, gotta cut the All right, okay, we have... Still nothing of any real use in here, I think. Not yet. Uh, oh, I wonder. Leaves. Get that off. Let's try something here. See, perhaps this is what they like to call a clue. No, it's not what they like to call a clue. Put the baby leaves in the cot where you find the other leaves. Nice. Put the baby leaves in the fire and breathe deeply. Mmm, toasty baby. There's a, the tree, like the thing near the wardrobe that looks like a baby. You wear the assassin's mask and then cut mm. it. Okay. I would not have thought of that one, to be totally honest with you. That's what I was saying. It's uh. kind of wonky. Thank you, Shizzy. No, can't put them in a the pestle and mortar. Okay. Right, let's get all hacky with the... Uh... That does look wrong. Uh, let's get all hacky with the baby. Yeah. <laughs> all right. You ask for this. Uh, no, not that one. How about a knife? No. I think um, it's the ritual blade. Which you may need to heat up, but I can't remember. Oh, here's my cat. Hi, Let's try that uh, because it would actually make sense. Image of a snake has appeared on the blade. It's been moved to the end, so you get to click extra hard. Can you hear her purring? She's purring super loudly. It's pouring. No, I can't hear anything over the baby crying. Uh, <laughs> oh, jug. Yeah, Okay, maybe I should use a different container. Paper basin. Oh, basin. Huh? What are uh, you? I'm bad. Sitting there giving out advice. I'm bad. What's yeah. this? Oh, flask? Maybe the flask is where you had to get the water. I don't want the blood in the flask. I used to drink. Oh dear, this music is so loud. I'm so sorry if it's hard to hear anything, guys. Alright, okay, I don't think... Well, I suppose we can use the pestle, can't we? No, I don't even bother. <laughs> no, I can't... I, I'm sorry, I can't cope with that music and the baby crying. I've got to get away from here. Okay. Um, uh, come on! Thank you. Yeah, she... uh. Um, okay, the basin does go on the hooks. I don't know. I think I have the sound turned off on my Twitch thing because I can never hear your your thing. Oh uh, dear. The it doesn't appear to make any difference whatsoever changing the volume and the the settings. It's been really quite frustrating. Yeah. Uh, it's a bit like playing The Sims Three. I mean, you, I've I've managed to change it the system level, which means. Yeah, the volume in the, in the system level is only about 10% what it's supposed to be. Yeah. And I'm really, really glad I set that now, because I probably wouldn't have eardrums left. Mm -hmm. Alright, okay, There's so... Oh, okay. What have we got? Um... Okay, I'm willing to bet that actually the basin is going to be used for washing hands, because it's got clean hands. 
It says, um, okay. Well, I've got a thing open that tells you what to do. Did you grab the child's hair? Tell you what. What's the time? It is half past ten. You, how long have you got, April? Um, well, you have to go. Somebody just texted me. Who texted me? Oh, I got an email. So, yeah, I got an email. Is that you, Mega Racer? Um, so, I can't check that right now. Uh, the baby hair is inside the bonnet, which is in the crib. Uh, wasted my time going here. Okay. Uh, what I'm thinking here is, uh, we are we a fair way through this game now? You're actually... Um, let me see. Let me scroll down. You're, yeah, you're pretty close-ish, but not super close. Okay. I, I feel like if you were to do this, uh, finish it up another time, it would would probably... Talk about out. Hotbot. So, like, I've got a little while. I haven't... Uh, he hasn't texted me yet that he's coming over, but... Okay. Um, yeah, apparently you, you use the leaves and you hook, you put the basin on the hooks, you use the leaves and the child's hair in the basin, and then you put in the oil and you light it. Okay. But I'm not finding a... Uh, it's in one of the cribs. There should be a bonnet, and you click on the bonnet and it gives okay. you hair. We've done two... I don't really need this hat on, do I? We've done two of them. Let's try them again looking <laughs> like this. Oh, yeah. Child's bonnet, there we go. Oh, Emmy wants up on my lap so badly, but she's not gonna because she cat types. Hello, Malaysia! Oh, yeah, I should make this bigger again so I can see. Okay, right, so we will put the jug and the basin on the hooks, no? <laughs> Save the baby tree. Basin on the hooks, there we go, like that, and... Um, yep, the leaves. Charles bonnet, there's hair inside. Oh, yeah, you had to put Charles hair in. in there, and what was the other thing? The leaves. Leaves, the leaves, the leaves, the leaves in there. And we'll stick some oil in. Emily, do not cat type. <laughs> oh, but you've been paying attention to the keyboard, so therefore I must sit on it. <laughs> Sing it later. Woo! There you go. <laughs> Very glad we did that. <coughs> Hello, Bert. Oh, we already grew the baby tree. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. So, so we've done the mirror. Yeah. And now. We still got the child's bonnet, so presumably, uh, presumably, we got some use for the child's bonnet still. Um, I'm wondering. I don't think so, but might. Um, the next step is using the tablets. Okay. Uh, all right. Okay. So let's. Well, let's 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 crack through this. Use the tablets. Let's do the tablets. <laughs> How do we do the tablets, April? <laughs> oh, do the tablets. Do the tablets. Yes. It's like doing the hustle. Yes, it's the it's the lazy crazy dance that all the kids are down with. <laughs> yeah. Uh yes, Mega Racer. That's it's all one word. Yeah. All one word. Excuse me. I'm derping. So um yeah, you, you go back into the room with the fire. Whoop, there uh -huh. she is. And then you put one of the tablets. I'll have to look at it to tell you which one it is. You put one of the tablets in the fire. Then you put the ring on that. And um, then... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry, just one sec. Um, uh, first of all, see you later, Simming Queen. Thanks for coming along. 
And I hope you've enjoyed yourself. So, okay, we go back to the room with the fire. Yes. Okay, and then... You put one of the tablets in the fire, and I need to look at them to tell you which one it is. Okay. I'm presuming there's a clue for this somewhere. Uh, yes, in one of the books. Um, I think you can click on the tablets to see what they look like. So you can get a closer look. Um, it's one of the ring ones. It's the one that kind of looks like a flower. That one. That one. Okay. Mm. Nothing is happening. Uh, the tablet alone can't react with fire. Take it back before it gets oh. too hot. Put the, put the ring on it first. Okay, let me find the tablet first. Is it right. in your or did I... Yeah, oh, yeah no, okay. So, right, we put the ring on it. I could make a Beyonce joke, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to tell you I could make a Beyonce joke. I've placed the ring in the incision on the tablet, and thank you so very, very, very much for not doing the Beyonce joke. <laughs> right. The ring, it's melting! It's melting! Fused gold is adapting with the incision on the tablet. Cool, we're piling up the achievements now, aren't we? Oh yeah. <laughs> it's a scorching oh, hot. It's, it's a, a it's just a scorching hot. It's a me, a Mario. The bar. <laughs> ah. Chimney shovel. And then I should probably go start doing. <laughs> probably. Um, and then, yeah, you should be able to take the ring off of the tablet. I'll find it first. Uh, I think it's the third one in. Nope, not anymore. Oh, did you Oh, there it, it is. It's on the floor. Oh. Whoops. Silly me. It's still very hot. I need to cool it down. Pour some water on it. Oh, from your flash. Yes. Alright, 35% of our animation budget went on that. I hope you guys appreciated it. <laughs> Alright, we now have the tablets. Let me get your ring back. <laughs> Shizzy almost made the Beyonce joke. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, Lee Audio is obviously far more sophisticated than the rest of us because she's doing talking jokes instead. Right, okay, <laughs> so what do we use that on? Um, there is a thing downstairs, so I lied. That's not the only thing you have to do downstairs. But I, I feel like you have to get into that other room. No, you gotta, I feel like you have to get into the chained thing, but... Yeah, well, I'm sorry. I, first of all, I do love the hands there, but I'm standing here, I'm thinking, you know, there's somebody very, very happy standing behind that door just waiting to see us. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yep, Kellyanne, what's her face? Stop. Do not start that. Okay? Do what? not. Every time I kill something, or and it seems to be every time something attacks me in the game and I kill it, these people start a save the whatever that was campaign. <laughs> uh, I get attacked by turrets. It's a save the, cam the turret campaign. I get attacked by wolves. It's a save the wolves campaign. I'm gonna get attacked by Eldritch Horrors, and it's gonna be save the Eld save the Cthulhu campaign, you know, the cuddly Cthulhu on the front of a car that Mega Race Twenty Five is going to make. Um, you might want to fill the canteen again because I can't remember to eat it. Still full. Oh, okay. Well, that's weird. Yeah. <laughs> it's the canteen that keeps on giving. <laughs> you want to go in the workshop? No, I don't. But I will anyway. Tell me if it's sauce, and then if it's not, I will. Mmm. Delicious. What are you cooking? What's that for? Oh, just a second. Yeah. Okay, sorry. I have my headphones on. I couldn't hear Kenny. You're hearing into the sordid details of our life. <laughs> yes. Thawed chicken. Psychological counseling is available for those who need it. You gotta put on the mask of truth. Of course. Of course. Of course. 
Yeah. Mask of Divine, Mask of Truth. Who would have thought not, not to put on the Mask of Truth at this point? <laughs> okay, so, so if you examine the left hand a bunch, because there's going to be a left hand on the wall, if you examine it, it will heal your sanity. Like, just keep examining it. I did it. There you go. The left hand. Unless they patched out that glitch. Uh, can the question here is can Bear's hands be left ladied? <laughs> right, massive clue about what we want to do here, and sanity's not coming back. Okay. Hmm, never really had a use for it anyway, so. <laughs> it don't fit. Um. Yeah, use the Let's... red pearl on the right hand. This stupid, stupid idea about, you know, sort of trying to put a ring on the right hand. I mean, what sort of thing am I thinking of here? <laughs> no, nope. perhaps we use it on the ring. Um, no, we should be able to... Okay, you're supposed to have bloody cinders. Uh, no. Hang on. I've got cinders. Look, I think there's a way you get down blood here. I can make blood easily enough. I wonder. The image of a snake has appeared on the blade. Hmm. Right. I don't know if you have to put the cinders in the flow of the baby blood. I don't want to cut my hands if I don't have to. <laughs> Yeah, right. I don't... I think... You have to get bloody cinders somehow. Right, well, there is a, a massive stream of blood going out, uh, out of this tree, so let's go and stick some... Too bad, Simon, it's gonna happen. Mega Racer 25? Okay, there's the challenge. All right, now we want to see a save the Eldritch Holler. God. <laughs> Uh, I think I got asked a question uh, because Kellyanne just answered it. I hope you haven't just proposed to the wall, Simon. Um, nah, I made that mistake once before. <laughs> okay, uh, not for that. Thank you. Okay, we're in the wrong hats. Stupid <laughs> me. <laughs> I'm gonna eat a pretzel. It's gonna make a noise. Ah. Mmm, pretzels. <laughs> They're spelt pretzels. Cinders! You shall go to the blood. Nope. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. Maybe you have to put the cinders in the bowl? Or not, um, the basin? Not the basin we've used, so if that's it, we've lost the game. So weird. Uh... I know something else which is bloody. The snake is Olga watching us. <laughs> you shall never work this else. <laughs> I'm I'm kind of scary, scared of the thought that Olga appears to be becoming far more popular than the Damien. Let's take this hat off. Okay, so. Alright, so we got. Actually, we've got blood soaked maple leaf, which we could possibly use. Let's try using that on the cinders. Nope. Try using the cinders on the cradle. Nope. I've tried stabbing myself. Nope. Yep, yep. Um, well, I couldn't snatch or stab myself with a sacrificial dagger. Let's try with the hunting knife. <laughs> nope. There's like. Ah, oh, there's a way, and I can't remember it, and I hate myself for it. 
This dagger has cooled itself again. No, let's heat the dagger up. Hey, is it done? It's still a bit frozen, so I can do the uh. You put it in a bowl and you're just running a little water over it? Alright, cool. cool. Well, I'm, I'm so very glad to hear that. What? Extra straws for everyone. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm gonna uh. How? We take the basin back. If you need to go, feel free to go. Oh. No, I'm okay. We're gonna play board games before we eat anyway. And look up Baby Cthulhu, it's awesome. Absolutely right. <laughs> Truth, what, true. Cinder, let's have a look at that. There you go, blood soaked Cinder. Oh! It was in the basin. Oh! Derpa 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 derp. That's yes, me being it, good it, at things. It obviously wasn't in the buffalo. Yup. <laughs> Okay, so now you have to put the stuff on the face. And you're supposed to rub the cinders yeah. on the head. Kind of like a, an Ash Wednesday thing. Okay, here's one for the chat. What's the difference between a buffalo and a bison? <laughs> I'm going to give people a couple of minutes to see if they can work that out, then I'll give the answer. Is it a joke? It's a joke. It's not a good joke. It's a joke that I picked up possibly when I was about seven, but it's still a joke. <laughs> right. The Mask of Truth. Um... Okay, Mega Racer. Yes. Okay, here we are. Oh, we can tell it's changed because it's now got this growing around it. It's a wedding arch. <laughs> Stonehead. Oh, so, so try the, I guess try the ring and the pearl first, because that's what the guide says. Okay. So we'll try the pearl. Uh, I think you passed it. Oh, I think I passed it as well. It's the right oh, hand. Hold on a sec. There we go. So, pearl on right hand, did you say? Yes. Yep. That one worked. Ooh. Oh, sanity. And then, yeah, keep examining the left hand so you get your sanity back. It don't fit. Oh man, did I tell you the wrong ring? Damn it. Crap. Damn it. Son of a. Confirm. Oh, hold on a sec. Let me just listen to this again. The lady's hand can't be left bare. Mm -hmm. Oath with the right seal. Okay, so I think you're actually right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the one that looks like a kind of uh, the outline that looks like a flower. Yeah. Um, okay, but uh, let's put some ashes on her head. Let's at okay. least do that one. There we go. Again, a tiny bit more of this totally unneeded sanity. Let's try putting it on now. It doesn't fit. Wait, let me see. Wait. Uh, but, but, the, um... Stonehead. Oh yeah, it says you will or use ring on left hand, you will be healed. So maybe it's the wrong ring. Yeah. In which case I'm so sorry. Well, that's okay. Let's see if we can remake that uh Yeah, um, you can you can remelt it. Well, let's give that a try. I'll place the ring in the incision on the tablet. Right. Let's get up there. Let's run using this non existent run button. <laughs> That'd be nice. Mm. I don't know, Simon. What is the difference between a buffalo and a bison? You can't wash your hands in a buffalo. <laughs> I did say it wasn't a good joke. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> Have you heard heavy breathing in this yet? I thought that was me, but okay. Um, if you hear heavy breathing, turn around. Mm-hmm. Because there's one sanity effect that you have not gotten yet. And it's driving me nuts because it's a good one. Yeah, I'm, I'm starting to think this guy is loving walking through this door. He enjoys it. Yeah. <laughs> Feels good. 
Okay, so if we hear a heavy breathing turn around, what about if we hear a voice asking us what underwear we're wearing? <laughs> Just tell them. Okay. Okay, let's look at the tablets. Well, I've already popped it on this one, because they all mm -hmm. look sort of vaguely flowery, so we'll stick that in there. I suppose I could have been sensible here and... Um, actually looked it up. But I didn't. It shows a picture. Right, water on... I think this is the wrong one. I think this is the wrong one because that uh, item hasn't disappeared. Yeah, I think you can pry the ring off. Yeah, you can pry the ring off and then you just put it with another tablet. Right, so actually that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to first of all take that off. And we'll put that on the last circular tablet there like that. It's the ring on the incision in the tablet. That's what's on the head. Yeah. I wonder if that's what they're supposed to be a clue. Right, stick that one in. And... The ring is melting! The gold is adapting. Yeah. All good one, gold. Chimney shovel. Yeah, oh, it's still there, out. okay. Alright, so that's not a clue. So, we'll try this one, and then we'll go back and try the other one in a sec, if this one doesn't work. It's it's one of the two that look like, uh, that have sort of like softly rounded edges. Well, this is the other one that had softly rounded what's its. Yep, what's it? Yeah. There you go. There's... Okay. Both of those rings look very similar. Hmm. <laughs> New sound effect. Oh, did which you is hear it? probably an indication. No, it's uh, a baby crying. But I was just thinking it's probably an indication that uh, we've actually advanced the story a touch. It's a sanity thing, I think. You're getting a little Dutch angly there. What does a what does Cthulhu look like? So I can get an idea. Um, it's sort of half squid, half soul destroying horror. I'm not freaked out by Lovecrafty and stuff. No. Well, no, to be totally honest with you, Lovecraft, and I hate to say this, Lovecraft was a terrible author. He, he, was, he had <laughs> really poor descriptive powers, but that's actually one of the reasons why his works worked so well, was because, you know, why describe the indescribable?